Hey, hello there, Lucky. I have your reading ready for you. This is your tarot card reading for July 26th of 2018. And you had a special question. You wanted to know why your family lost faith in that you would ever remember them. Your first card, it's the background of the question. It's the basis of the matter. It is the Four of Pentacles. The Four of Pentacles. As you can see, he's holding on. They were being cautious with their money, holding on and being defensive, which is blocking new opportunities. Their foundation is firm, and they're protecting their money and boundaries. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. They're holding on to their fixed attitude, which limits and blocks new opportunities. If they would just take a risk, they would get things going again. They're being self-protective. Security and control are uppermost in their thoughts. They do not want to chance anything. They are claiming ownership and protecting investments and clinging on to security. The shadow to this card is miserliness, hoarding, holding grudges, and self-absorption. Advice is to be generous in wealth and spirit. The second card this is a major card. This is the Magician. It's a number one in the Rider Waite deck of the Major Arcana. These are major things that happen in your life. This is the second card, which is energy that is crossing over you. It is the immediate future. This is a major new beginning. It's new opportunities. This is a time for action huge potential for abundance. Use your will and mastery and skills and creative talents. This is the ability and the will to succeed. There is leadership potential and ambition and a desire for action and new relationships coming into being. This is the ability and the talents to accomplish what you set out to do. Use vision, decision, and action. Your third card and this is how it affects you. This is the Ace of Pentacles. The Aces are always new beginnings and they're things that you should grasp. They're opportunities. This is a gift from the universe. This is a healthy new beginning. There's new money and new success. There's an opportunity for real growth. This is the beginning of a new project it's the beginning in building the foundation for a better future. You can spend time in nature to find new inspiration. This card represents recognizing your calling your, as your fate and chance. This is a positive reward for hard work. Also a lump sum of money or a gift. Also worldly status and achievement. What you will be doing is breaking new ground, seeking wealth and security, offering or receiving money, and creating value. Your fourth card, it's the future card. It's the outcome. It is the number 17, another major card. The star, number 17, the star. This is the card for the zodiac sign of Aquarius. This is a card that stands for great love and great hope. There's renewal and peace. There's realization of dreams and goals. They're now possible. This is nurturing a dream. This is your lucky stars are with you, lucky, in your venture. So make the most of the now. This is bright promises. This is a good time to begin a new project or relationship as it carries blessings with it. There are positive energies flowing freely into your life. This is the presence of the Holy Spirit is with you. You are going to be hopeful, peaceful, and cooperative, charitable, devoted, 
and self-acceptoring, nurturing, appreciative, and spiritually replenished. You're an aspiring to an ideal, giving from a sense of infinite supply, forgiving, and pouring out gratitude, nurturing a dream, trusting life, and offering hope. A gate has opened and a new, happier phase of life is coming in, a wish coming true. And you really deserve that, Lucky. You really do. The fifth card, it's what's unseen. It's the underlying issue. It is the Three of Wands. The Three of Wands. And that is a realization of hope. Seeing your ship coming in. These are things set in motion and letting go of past hurts. There's a bright future ahead, expanding horizons and maybe even foreign travel. I hope you like your reading. Love and light. <laughs>